So I started in New York City in 2004, I can do the math too well. I decided that I was gonna go solo, that I was gonna start my own cosmetic company and I was gonna do my own spa and I was gonna be opening a spa in Fifth Avenue because I needed to be in Fifth Avenue, in a mailbox on Fifth Avenue. So I can use that as my mailing address. And then I started a cosmetic company and that sort of like was going really slow. When we moved to LA, we talked about downtown LA. Downtown LA was the promised land at the time. It was up and coming, it was booming. And then I thought of it, I'm like, you know, this is gonna be my my place. This is where I'm gonna open my spot. So I decided to start my business from home. I used to drive by Sprint, Broadway, and I used to see so many people, and I was like, this is fun, this is where I'm gonna be. So I knew downtown LA was gonna be coming, the mecca of, of California. I saw the potential and I was not afraid to take a risk. There's so much. And I knew this was where I had to open my spot. You know, I knew I was going to have to defeat the odds and take a chance. I moved in very shy at the SB Spring and I got one of the penthouses. So I got me a duplex. I was work, I was living home and then I was working from, from downstairs. So I live upstairs and then downstairs I have my spot. And my business just started growing from there. 2000 and 11, 12, I started looking for a location. I couldn't find a location. Nobody wanted to rent me a place. I'm not gonna do this, it's hard. Nobody wants to rent a spot to a woman. 2013, my husband now was a friend at the time, Keith, and he started coming with me to a lot of this, like, you know, location to search for, for spot. Suddenly, I was a good candidate for this location. I am a destination location. I do bring a lot of clients and I know how to really do marketing. I remember this basement. I never really liked it. It was torn apart. It was nothing. It was really hidden. The entrance wasn't going to be too visible. So I was talking to this place. I was really not too convinced. I was really not. Then the more I came and toured the place, the more I convinced myself, yeah, Daisy, you can, you can make it work. It took us three years to finally build this location. So it was one thing after another, you know, it was just so much going on, but we, we were able to defeat all the odds and we're here. And without me even realizing, I realized that I ended up opening a spa on Fifth Street. <laughs> I have been able to create such an amazing space away from the city, quiet, relaxing. We have amazing therapists, people that give their heart. We have, you know, I curated all the treatments that we have and there's a lot of things that you're not gonna be able to find anywhere else. It doesn't matter when you do have a, when you do have a will, the universe will find ways to make it happen. We already two years in this location and just keep growing. This is Destination, and downtown is about creating your own, you know, individual, unique space. It's about a lot of, you know, independent owners. It's not about corporate and people just being creative and just doing their own art. In the historic court, yes, I can probably I can probably say that I was the first spot. My neighbors, because I want to call everybody a neighbor, but the spirit, they are such a positive, outgoing, happy community. You know, they don't know you. They will say hi. Everybody kind of like knows everybody. And I started seeing more people walking around with their strollers, and there's more daycares coming up and opening left and right. So I thought, yes, I'm, why not? I don't want to move. I'm gonna raise a family here and I'm gonna run my business from downtown and and I now have two kids. But we're like a close community. We're in here and we're giving our our life for this neighborhood. We wanna fight, we wanna grow, we wanna try. And that's one of the things that I love. Downtown LA needs more of this. They need more spot. They need more places that people can just get away and relax and kind of like declutter their, their mind from all the noise and the craziness from the city. And I think I am really good at bringing that.